Hi, this is Adrienne with Two Bostons. I'm here to talk to you about a few key things to look for in your ingredient listing on your dog's or cat's bag of food. When you're looking at the ingredients, you wanna make sure that they are very specific. So I'm talking about the difference between chicken or poultry or even animal. When you see a protein listed, you wanna see something that's very specific like chicken, beef, elk, something like that. You know what the animal is. Now, if it starts getting a little bit too um, vague and they start talking about poultry, that should be a big red flag because there is no such thing as a poultry. So kind of a rule of thumb is if uh, you ask a two-year-old to tell you what that noise that animal makes, they should be able to tell you. A two-year-old does not know what, what sound a poultry makes because there is no such thing as a poultry. Now, when you get very unspecific like um, animal, that is when it's time to close that bag up and refuse to give it to your animals. Uh, when it says animal, it can be anything and everything, including, I know a lot of you don't wanna hear this, but including euthanized cats and dogs from different areas. That can actually be put into the rendering meat and be put into your dog or cat's foods. So again, just make sure that all of your ingredients are very specific. Any questions, come in and talk to us. We'll be happy to talk through it.